When they say she get it from her mama Mama say you fuck her right Your body blue is pump like Dumb me in the hall But come tell me is you down Cause I'm tryna go good tonight All in hope she slept right I just Okay, so let's go ahead and lay that wig, okay? Um, so you get it in a bag. It comes with a regular degular things that you get, lashes, um, a hair cap. And the hair cap is what I've used for the bold cap method. So that's what we have. And I'm excited about this wig. I'm not going to lie. I have never worn a blonde wig before. So this is my first time. I'm going to see what it looks like. It's a 28-inch 5x5 closure blonde hair it's not entirely blonde it's highlighted so it has like the blonde highlights in different sides of the hair obviously as you guys can see and then it comes with this band which i always take off i never keep it in because i'm like what's the point um and then sometimes i even take some of the pins out but i just use the straps in the back to secure it and a five by five closure little to no work i'm not gonna lie the closure is transparent it's literally so beautiful you don't have to do so much you might have to maybe pluck a thing or two to make it look you know very natural but besides that i like to style my wigs right out of the package so i can show you guys what it looks like if you had to do that so yes this is what it looks like when you put it on and again it's beautiful the five by five is really done well i realized that my closure um my bald cap was a little too forward so i had to cut some off which i did and then we're gonna go ahead and just install the wig make her look nice okay so i will leave a link for this hair it's linked on my amazon it's from amazon so it's linked on my amazon storefront as always i will leave a link for you guys but I am going to use my wax because this hair is so soft and has a lot of flyaways. I'm not even going to lie. It does have a lot of flyaways. So it requires a lot of like hot comb and wax, hot comb and wax, hot comb and wax. And that's always the trick to getting your wigs to lay flat and make them look like really nice and, you know, cute or whatever. <laughs> um, but yes, I'm going to use my hot comb to just make sure that the hair is positioned well and then also you know i'm just styling the hair in a way that i can be able to lay it's just pushing the hairs away from the front just so that when i lay that wig i don't have any hairs coming in the way it's so blonde literally is what i said it is so blonde right my hair is so blonde but it's also so beautiful i got a lot of compliments when i put this wig on everybody said it worked really well with my skin color and i'm like oh that's cool but i don't know if i can wear it out every day i don't think i can um but again it's a beautiful hair i feel like this is going to be more sort of like an occasion type of hair like my birthday i might use this for photo shoots you know what i'm saying initially i wanted to dye black because i'm like i like the hair too much to not wear it but then i'm also like i don't want to mess up the work that they've done with the blonde because whoever dyed it they did it so well they put the highlight in the right places and the color match is just so beautiful so i'm not gonna touch it um next i'm gonna use a lace tint to just tint the lace um you know just make sure that it suits my color this lace tint is also from amazon i will leave a link for you guys um but this is the darkest brown shade so it matches my skin color perfectly fine and that's what it looks like i also sprayed my bald cap just so that it will match the lace for the wig and you know i, I feel like the foundation and the powder i mean i don't mind that but i feel like the lace spray is a lot better because foundation is like you you have product sitting there i mean i don't know I, i'm just saying okay i'm just saying <laughs> so let's go ahead and lay the wig i'm putting it up in a claw clip just pushing it away and then installing the wig And then next, I'm going to use my Eben Wonder Lace Spray to just lay the wig down. If you know, if you've watched some of my installs from the past, I usually like to spray one layer of the glue on my actual like hairline. And then I would spray one over the wig. So I do two 
one under one over i say that every time one under one over so that's my trick it works perfectly fine it melts that wig like magic okay it melts it like magic so i'm gonna go ahead and lay the wig i should have definitely cut that lace because it's so small <laughs> that now after i put it down and then i went back in to cut it it was giving me trouble so definitely if you get this wig i would say cut the lace before you place it on the glue or before you use the glue because once it starts to lay because the lace is so small and there's pretty much nothing to cut off you you definitely want to cut it off before you put the glue because once it's down it's down okay But I just went ahead to cut it off and then I'm using the glue over the wig, like I said. So one under, one over. Sometimes I'll use one under, lay that, like, you know, tie it down and then take it off and put one over. So, yeah. And another trick, cut, please, cut your bands into half, okay? Your wig bands, cut them into half. They lay a lot more, like a lot, lot better if it's small than if it's big if the width is big i don't know if what i'm saying makes sense but the band that you used to lay your wig cut it into two the smaller it is the much better you're getting a frontal to lay without the hair getting in the way if it's big it's holding out like it's holding on to hair that it's not supposed to be holding on to if it makes sense okay so cut it into two and use that it's a lot so it's better okay so now i'm just going ahead to curl the hair and just you know put some it's already wavy i didn't really want to do so much i'm not gonna lie because i get really lazy when i have to curl my hair and I'm, I'm a straight snap curl type of person i like to use my straight snap to just bring some curls um but this particular hair is wavy and i figured the curling wand would you know give it much more life so that's what i'm doing putting some curls just adding some body making it have life or whatever and then i can move on to you know adding a little more glue just a little more because i don't know i don't think i actually did that no i didn't do that and oh i just wanted to say my little girl was just in and out of the studio when i was filming so i didn't want to like that's why when i was tinting the hair i sprayed it off camera because i didn't want to like get the chemicals in her nose but yeah and then i'm going to use some more wax to again mold the hair and keep it in place make sure that it's nice and flat and this one thing about this hair that i saw it was literally like like a doll's hair you know when you get a doll from the supermarket or whatever for your kids or when you were a kid and you would comb their hair and the hair just stays in place it was so easy to comb that's how the hair feels like when you comb this hair it literally feels like the hair's on a doll like it's so beautiful when you use the hot iron it stays right there so i like it it's beautiful in that sense like when it's it stays in place it's a respectful type of hair like it's not gonna be moving around but it definitely has a lot of flyaways i'm not gonna lie like a lot Okay, and then I'm gonna go ahead and take that band off um, and then you know see what it's looking like but I love it I'm not gonna lie I have no questions asked it was super easy to install you guys can see that um, the lace tint makes it very easy to match my skin I can put just a little teeny with teeny 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 <laughs> bit of foundation to make it match a little more um, but I'm just cleaning up the pads, making sure that it looks, you do see that we have a pad. So that pad, I'm definitely using some sort of concealer to make it pop. Um, but yeah, this is basically the install. Overall, my thoughts on this hair, it's beautiful. Um, you know, the hair quality itself is there. Okay, the hair quality itself is like it's giving what it's supposed to give its lustrous it's full you know it's giving bodsy it's giving a big girl hair and i love that but it's blonde and it's not exactly in my comfort zone <laughs> i'm not gonna lie it's cute so i'm gonna wear it one time or two times sometimes i don't know but it's cute i will leave a link for you guys any girl that is looking for this type of blonde hair definitely try checking this out if you're not so good with laying frontals or closure this is actually very perfect for you because you don't have to do so much from what you guys can see um, i didn't do so much with laying the hair i'm just 
I've literally just been molding the hair using wax and hot comb the whole time. So the install itself, the glue and trying to lay the wig, it's literally no trouble. Literally no trouble. So I'm just like, I like things to look good and to look perfect. So I'm just trying to make sure that the style suits me and looks good. But overall, the install, I love it. The hair, I love it. It's giving. It's giving what it's supposed to give. So I'm here for it. Um, but this is this is literally it. I'm just cleaning up my part, making sure that I parted the hair well to suit my face. I like me a good like ketting bang situation. Um, I like for my my hair to like mold my face. So I'm just making sure that I have it in a way that it looks good for me. And so yeah, that's basically it. <laughs> that is basically it for the hair. Okay. and this is what it looks like without makeup on and this is the true length of the hair it gets all the way down to like my waistline i guess that's what that's what it is and then this is the back you have some highlights in the back as well it's really beautiful just prepare to get a lot of stairs if you're if you can if you don't mind um but this is the final look i put on some makeup made it look cute i love this hair comment below if you have any questions comment anything um but always the link will be in the description box for you guys i love you guys so much for always coming by and i will see you in my next insta bye <laughs> When they say she get it from her mama I'ma say you fuck her right Your body boot is bump like Tell me in the hall But come tell me is you found Cause I'm tryna go good tonight All the hoochies left and right I 